Good Tuesday morning, everybody. This is Steve Monday, Chief Forecaster for Rowan County Weather. Let's go ahead and take a look at what's going on weather-wise around the area this morning. We've got 41 degrees to start the day off at the Mid-Carolina Airport in Salisbury. 39 here at the Weather Center in Atwell. And temperatures range anywhere from 30 degrees up in Jefferson all the way up to, it looks like 45 degrees is the warm spots on the map. Uh, looking at Charlotte and then over toward Monroe coming in at 45 degrees to start the day off with warm conditions. The good news is as we go through the day today, the winds are going to be light. So nothing like we've seen over the last couple of days. But we're going to have mostly cloudy conditions throughout the day today and tomorrow before rain chances move in as we head into Thursday. And we could see a chance for severe weather on Thursday with this system as well. Here it is right here making its way through the country. It's uh, a little bit disorganized right now moving through. And the good news is, is based on what I'm seeing from the model data, a lot of this stuff's going to be broken up as it comes through uh, the county uh, on Thursday. We could see mainly two main waves from it that would bring us the severe weather chances. One would come through during the morning hours and the second wave would come through closer to the evening hours. We'll continue to work on the timing of that as we go through the next couple of days, but looking like I'd say anywhere between 8 and 11 a.m. for that first wave in the morning on Thursday, and I'd say somewhere between 5 and 8 p.m. for that second wave Thursday evening. So uh, not that it wouldn't be raining with some scattered shower activity or something in between, but those seem to be the two main waves for the potential for severe weather. The Storms Prediction Center right now has us in the darker shade of green there's salisbury right there and we're in that darker shade of green meaning we have a marginal risk for severe weather but if you look to each uh each direction of us there in the northeast there's a slight chance for it up there in that yellow shade and then also a slight chance to our southwest the yellow shade so i wouldn't be surprised if they join these two areas together over the next 24 to 48 hours, making a slight risk right through this entire area here, which would include all of Rowan County if they do that. We'll continue to keep an eye on that and keep you updated on it. Let's go ahead and take a quick break. We'll get a word from our friends at Patterson Farm. We'll come back, we'll give you the weather impacts, the pollen outlook and more. All that's coming up right after this. <music> Weather impacts for today, pretty simple, mostly cloudy skies throughout the day. Winds will be light. Uh, again, the conditions will be mostly cloudy again this evening, so not a whole lot to it today. Uh, the weather impacts are sponsored by Patterson Farm. The 2022 all-season passes are on sale right now. You saw the details for that during the break. For more information, visit pattersonfarm.com forward slash all hyphen season hyphen pass. You can purchase your passes there as well. Make sure you use promo code Farm Fund during checkout. You'll save $10 off that purchase. And that promo code is valid for a few more days until the end of the month. So certainly a great opportunity to save some money and visit the farm often by making that one-time purchase on the all-season passes. The Pollen Outlook, sponsored by Good Nights Lawn Care. These guys take care of my lawn, and I love it. They offer services like mowing, trimming, seeding, mulch, pine straw, and more. For more information on services provided, give them a call, 980-521-1937. Main pollen drivers continue to be maple, juniper, and poplar. You can see we've got extreme levels for most of the forecast period, with the exception of Thursday, when that chance for severe weather comes through. So we'll continue to keep an eye on that for you and continue to keep you updated. The mowing forecast overall looks pretty good, mostly cloudy conditions today and Wednesday. We'll keep things dry, and that'll certainly help to get it done today and Wednesday. On Thursday, I've got that yellow light out there. Again, we do have the chance for severe weather on Thursday. But as I mentioned earlier, it seems to be two uh, main waves that could bring that severe weather chance to us really between 8 and 11 in the morning on Thursday and then again around 5 to 8 p.m. Thursday 
evening. So we'll continue to keep an eye on that, continue to fine tune the forecast for you. But you might be able to squeeze it in, in between those two waves. So that's why we've got the yellow light out there for now. The forecast sponsored by SA Sloop Heating and Cooling, built on integrity. Give them a call, 704-857-5684. Visit them on their website, www.sasloop.com. Mention you notice they sponsor the forecast on Rowan County weather. They'll give you $25 off your first time service call. Mostly cloudy skies today, high of 57, low of 41. Those mostly cloudy conditions continue on Wednesday with a high of 70 and a low of 59. Thursday, we've got a chance for severe weather. Uh, we'll continue to keep you updated on that as we get closer to Thursday. 100% chance of showers and thunderstorms on Thursday with a high of 73, low of 48. On Friday, sunny skies, high of 68 with a low of 40. Saturday, partly sunny skies, high of 68 with a low of 43. I do have a 30% chance of rain in there for Saturday, but it would happen around 10 p.m. Saturday evening. So rain would move in pretty late in the evening hours and maybe last a little bit to the overnight. But by the time we get into the day on Sunday, we'll have sunny skies with a high of 68 and a low of 41. If you're looking for ways to stay updated with Rowan County weather at any time, you can visit us on our website, www.rowancountyweather.com. You can follow and like us on our social media pages, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And you can check us out on cable television, WSRG TV in Salisbury. It's available on Hotwire Channel 394, Spectrum Channel 16. We'll keep you updated there as well. For now, enjoy your Tuesday. And as always, thank you for following Rowan County weather.